So he was wearing a big, massive, thick coat, though, wasn't he? So we couldn't see his uh, fast sense. Yeah, he but he was wearing it for a reason, wasn't he? Because it's, it's gold. freezing. <laughs> it's gold. It certainly is. In fact, overnight tonight, the first real hard frost of the season. Uh, we'll get to that in a minute. Let's look at look a couple of pictures from today. There was a fair bit of cloud around this morning, for, especially across Merseyside, the odd shower as well. But actually, it brightened up nicely. Cloud cleared. It brightened from the north. And then for this afternoon, I mean, most of us have had clear blue skies. Still a bit blustery, so there has been a wind chill factor for today. Thanks, Pedro, for sending that picture in. So what's going on? Well, high pressure continues to build from the north, so that leads us to a lovely day tomorrow. Look out to the west, though. Low pressure's trying to come in for Sunday. Has given us a bit of a headache, but at the minute, definitely the better day of the weekend looks to be tomorrow. So if you are out through this evening, wrap up. It's a chilly night. Now, the winds will continue to ease down, so with a light breeze, clear skies, we are looking at a widespread frost overnight tonight. Now, these temperatures are in towns and cities, so we'll get cooler than that in more rural spots. The air's quite dry, so there probably won't be too much in the way of fog first thing tomorrow morning. But it'll be dry and it'll be sunny, beautiful. In fact, a really lovely, crisp day, clear blue skies, plenty of sunshine. And because the winds won't be as strong, while the temperatures will be lower than we've had lately, much lower, around about five to seven degrees, the winds won't be as strong, so we'll lose that wind chill. Now, we go through into Sunday, again, cold and frosty to start, but you can see for the Isle of Man, cloud thickening up, and that cloud is going to roll across all parts. For many of us, rainfall amounts during daylight hours will be minimal, but we are expecting some heavy downpours, especially for the Isle of Man, where here temperatures will be in double figures, 10 degrees. Now, that front is going to continue to work its way across, getting quite heavy. You can see it clears as we go through Monday. So, actually, behind that, it will brighten up once again. Then we're exposed to this northeasterly. So, again, a chilly air mass to come through. That's into Tuesday and Wednesday. And this is the next headache for the middle part of next week. Depending on where this area of low pressure settles, could give us some snow to lower levels, but that is a long way off. So at this stage, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday look fine. And then Thursday, we are expecting to see some rain and potentially some hill snow as well. But back to this evening, if you are heading out, don't forget to wrap up. You're probably going to want to put the heating on tonight, I'm afraid, because it will get chilly. But tomorrow, we're looking at a gorgeous day with good spells of sunshine. The better day for the weekend. Of course, it's marble-like. Uh, Christmas switch on, oh, and yeah. it's going to be Lovely. fine and dry and gorgeous. Have fun. Are you doing that, Rainy Chance? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, just before uh, we.